Guys, do you know what day it is today? It's cube day. Only 160 players. Doesn't even matter. How long does it keep up? Till April 25th. Nice. Dude. Yeah, it's like a month. <gasps> wow, you can tell it's popular because you just hop right into this bad boy and you are good to go. Look at all these beautiful cards. <sighs> oh man, this is nice. Thank you. Mitch, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. <clears throat> Welcome, Baku. Like wax, welcome wax main Baku. What are we taking here, man? I like either Elspeth or Emrakul. You like Elspeth? I like Dak Faden. It's not, but there's no moxes. There's still like swords and Grimonolus and things. Plus, Dak Faden lets you put things in the graveyard. You ever put things in the graveyard before? Yeah, it's pretty alright. Man, I always put things in the graveyard. If you know what I mean. Huh? I don't. Yeah, I don't either. It was a weird. Three straight Ethereal Absolutions in Draft 1-2. Well, on the bright side, you uh, you beat it once. I don't think Arcane Artisan is that nuts. But I guess I'm... Uh, I don't think it's bad, by any means. I just think probably Dak Faden's a little stronger, but... Yeah, get those weird spiders. I, you got to. I'm going to take the Dak Faden. <clears throat> it's a fair choice. All right, your, your pick. Oh, we're alternating now? Yeah, might as well. It's not going to be a blind one. We'll do a blind one some other time. What was the way to sneak them? Was it Arcane Artisan? Because one of those will probably come back. Arcane Artisan will probably come back. LaFoof, what's going on, buddy? Long time no see. It's kind of just like Bolt here. Bolt? Yeah. I like a good Bolt. All right. You sure? It's final answer? Yeah. Thank Ooh. you. Secret Alien. Thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. So much of a secret if he has it in his name. Well, but then you throw people off and they're like, well, yeah, see, and then they say that. And they're like, maybe it's not that big of a secret after all. But then it is. And then he just totally, he next leveled you. Maybe. Cyclonic Rift is nice. Plateau is nice. I do like a Plateau. I think it's probably Plateau. It's not even white yet, though. It's a dual land, Michael. And it's in at least one of our colors. <clears throat> you don't take the dual land when you're Thank in the colors. You take the dual land so you can take the colors. No, you take it when you're in the colors. Okay, well, you do both. Erk, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Oh, sorry. It's my turn. Yeah, I'm waiting. Um, He is the greatest thief in the multiverse. <laughs> None of those others were the greatest anything in the multiverse. <laughs> That's a good point. What were you the greatest of in the multiverse? Tinker's Nothing. Not, Tinker's not in this format, right? No. Hmm. No, because I think it's illegal in Legacy. Illegal! <laughs> it's against the law. Um, I think it's Magma Jet. Do you? Yeah. Magma Jet mm -hmm. I wish you could pronounce it correctly. I can't. I know. All right, I'll take a Magma Jet. I don't love it. I'll take it. Oh, I like an Ula, Ula Smog. <coughs> be, be quiet, please. Can't help it. Yes, you can. Billy, what's going on? What's going on? My name is Jeff. Did you guys know that my name is Jeff? Uh, I really don't know what to take here. I could take Inspiring Vantage and keep going with the Plateau thing. We could take Mana Confluence. Ma yeah, Mana Confluence. Uh, I think we're just going to take... I think we're just going to take Ulamog. I just like the potential for Ulamog. I don't know what we can actually do with an Ulamog in this format, but... Yeah, you're getting all the good picks. Me? Yeah. You think Lamar was a good pick? Maybe not. Maybe not. Why don't you just why don't you just take your pick and then stop? Uh, probably Man of War. Man of War? Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing really great in this pack. Actually, we could have taken the the Runaway Steam Cannon and just been mono red because it feels like we could be mono red. Who wants to do that though? Your mom. Oh, does she? My dad. Mm, your mom, my mom, and your dad. Your mom, your mom, dad. Your mom, dad. Oh, boy. Do I just take Ugin? I just take all the big things? And then you're like, well, I don't even know how I, how I play this deck. It was a daze, too. I like this Veraska in here. What a glorious day. 
It took the days. What a glorious days. What a glorious day. That's actually pretty good. I like that. <laughs> oh my god. And then he died. What does that Hellkite do? What do you do? Meh. And it's a 4 4 hasty dragon for 5. Yeah, I think it's probably the pick, unfortunately. You don't think Sinister Sabotage is good? Pure Meta Counter Spell? Mm -hmm. I'll be. I'm out. Okay, I'll take it. I'll respect your choice. Oh, look, the Emerald. Oh, this is actually the. Did this pack. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oh, this is pack 2. Right? 1, 2, 3, no. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We have 8 cards, so this had to be pack 2, because it's. No! No, this is pack 1. Did this? Did pack 1 have both Emeralds in it? I guess it did. Did I just miss? Did I just miss that we had two Emeralds in this pack? That's weird. I mean, I think it's probably Emrakul here. We'll figure out something to do with them. I can't believe you passed Steamkin. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Terminus, I guess? Terminus. Mm -hmm. hmm. We got a white duel. Yeah, I'm sure we'll play a turn. This is a Terminus deck for sure. What deck isn't a Terminus deck? Okay, it's a Miracle. It is a miracle. He's right. <laughs> it's... Stop it. I'll kill you. I will murder you right on the stream. They'll never find your body. They can never <laughs> I think connect. they will. No, I'll hide it. There's, there's literally a video of it. Though. I'll eat it. <laughs> well, that's They'll not... They'll never find They're it. They're still going to arrest you. There's a video of you murdering me. I'm not going to record the murder. It's on the internet right now. The video of me murdering you is on the internet it right now? It will be if you murder me on camera. I just said I won't, though. Oh, okay. Never mind that. <laughs> Unbelievable. This is why you're getting killed. <clears throat> I'm at work watching you guys right now, and I'm itching to jump into a... Yeah, I know. This is, how it, this is how it does. Look at all these powerful cards I get to play. Or not play. I don't even care if I lose, because I'm not playing with three twos for two. Or three. And four fours for six. That's, a, that's normal draft cards. I don't even care. <clears throat> is it my pick or your pick? I think it's mine, but it doesn't really matter. Just take the uh, Blooming March. I'm going to take the Marshall Coup because it's white and we might be oh, white. Fair. Oh, wow. Speak of the devil. Or this guy. Ooh. <coughs> I'm going to take the card we might play. Oh, Devil's Play? Or Seeker? What's your choice, man? Devil's Play. Okay. You made the right choice. I really appreciate that. It's it's alternating. It's not really a step. We're just we. I just chose to have Mike do the second pick, and then we just kept going like that. It's also not blind. So, oh, we got a Beast Whisper and a Deafening Clarion in here. Boop, 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 wow. boop, 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 boop. You want to make first pick? Whoa. No, it's your turn. No, it's your turn because you picked, uh, you picked Devil's Play, and then I picked Dark Ritual. It was the last oh, okay. pick, and then now you get to pick. <clears throat> Sure, give me the crappy pack, why don't you? Is this crappy? Yeah. My bad. Okay, we have I'll take it. I'll take Fiery Confidence. You can get the next one. No, that's there. what I would have picked. Too anyway. bad. There you go. Now you get another pick. Because you because you whined about it. But that was what I was going to pick. Okay, then it's my pick again. Fine. God. I like Spellseeker, but I like it better in Vintage Cube, where you can actually get Time Walk and Ancestral Recall. I don't know how good it is here. You can get Lightning Bolt, I guess. There's a lightning bolt in this pack? No, in our, in our. Oh, deck. you can get lightning bolt. You can also get daze. And magma jet. Take bolus or rye. We have no black mana. Plus bolus will probably table, whereas like, pia or spellseeker probably won't. What do we take here, man? We could also take opposition. We are not an opposition deck. We have five creatures right now. Yet. When two of them are, are Ulama, two of them are Eldrazi. Mm, a fair point. And one of them, I don't want to really tap this guy. This is like we have no creatures. What about Warm Power Stone? It's all right. You trying to play them big boys? I don't think we're casting Ulamog off a of Warm Power Stone in this deck. I think we're probably trying to cheat it into play somehow. Oh, I think we can upheaval here. Upheaval. We could also probably get that Warm Power Stone back. Bolus uh, uh, <laughs> uh, finds a way. I guess it's upheaval. 
I think it's upheaval. Upheaval is super strong. I agree with you. Mystic Confluence? We get the double to double confluences? Oh, for sure taking that. This pack's not even that good. Got a Rafellos in here, though. Also a Rick's Mad Eye Reveler. Snappy Boy seems pretty good for us. You want Mindstone? Oh, Ancient for... Tomb, though. Ancient Tomb's Ancient pretty good. good, too, but... It's really strong. Yeah, but I like... Yeah, I guess that's true. It's up to you, man. Tomb it is. Tooming and booming. That is what I say. When have you said that? Every day. Forever. Every every chicken Sunday. Every day forever, huh? Wow. I don't know how I feel about this card. You create two O twos as long as you have an illusion. It's a it's got four or five hex proof. It's actually probably not terrible. What set is that even from? It's from the new one, Ravnica Allegiance. I think it's probably better than Dual Caster Mage. It's probably better than Brainstorm. We have no fetches. Whatever. I also haven't played it yet in the cube, so I kind of want to see how it is. Michael, living on your birthday, because it's Chicken Sunday. Battle Boy? I mean, it probably is, but we have just so many expensive cards already. So let me know when your final, well, let me know what your final answer is. Yeah, it's just Battle Boy. There's nothing really good in this pick. Oh, right. Battle Boy. <coughs> uh oh, now we're Tooth and Nailing. Are we? No, probably not. I like Charter Course. Oh, Charter Course lets us discard one of these things. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take a Charter Course. Sword. Reach him and breach him. That is what they say. I've heard him say that before. Scrubbed right out of that draft. People play the worst freaking cards on Arena that I never see played in paper. Don't get mad at the other people. If the cards are so bad, then why did you lose to them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got him. The Nickel Bullis came back. Worn Power Stone. Was this the Worn Power Stone pack? Yeah, it was. I think so. Fortunate. Is it Anger or Spellseeker? It's probably Spellseeker, right? It just gets better over time. Cookie Boy? Or Makeshift Boy? Did you say Cookie Boy? Is it Clicky Boy? There's a click in here? No, there's not. It's a Makeshift. That's what that's what it is. Clicky Boy? I mean Makeshift Boy. <laughs> Are you, you drunk? Every day. Every day you're drunk too? Yeah. It's too early for me to be happy to losing to garbage cards. Well, I mean, that's true. It's my pick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm going to take this Kolagon's command. Your turn. Ravages of War. <laughs> Ooh, Faithless Looting is nice there. No, I'll take the Sauger. All right, my turn. What can it be? Knocking at my door. Oh, Containment Priest. That feels new. Rekindling Phoenix seems good. Yeah, Rekindling Phoenix seems like the pick here. Solace and Lacrim are also pretty good, actually. Hmm. Hmm. Fascinating. Mm. I wonder if this Rekindling Phoenix will come back. Ravages of War never changes. <laughs> I feel like Red's been uh, tabling pretty well. I agree. I'm going to take the Solemn because it ramps us to all this heavy... This okay, it ramps us to all this fat shit. <laughs> Got him with that one. He, I was like, he's going to like this. He's going to like this, he is. It's your turn, buddy. Yeah, I'm thinking. I'm waiting. I think it's... Is it Deep Analysis? Manic Vandal is great, dude. I'm not talking I'm talking to Lefeuf, not, not to you. Could be Deep Analysis. 
We can also discard with like faceless face faceless looting or charter course. Or Dak Faden. Actually pretty good. Yeah, I like deep analysis. Ooh, Threaten Dynamo seems very good with upheaval and these fat boys. Fat bottom boys. Oh, so does sneak attack though. Yeah, sneak attack's pretty good. Oh buttery biscuits. No. No buttery biscuits? No buttery biscuits. I'm gonna take sneaky. Sneaky McSneakerson. Probably Goblin got here. Over Ancestral Vision? I'm kidding. Oh my god, I was like, what? Yeah, We're not probably, even a Goblin guy today. Yeah, it's 100 percent ancestral. I agree with that. So far, I'm kind of going to take this upheaval out. Yeah, we don't have any. We have no way to really take advantage of it. Everything else seems fine, though. Is this an auger? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I never feel like any deck is an auger of bolus deck, to be quite honest. He assuredly always whiffs. He really does. I guess it's just Phyrexian Revoker here. I don't think it's Bedlam Reveler. Black Cleave Clips could be interesting, but... Eh, we have Colagon's Command. That's probably Black Cleave. Yeah, I'll take a Black Cleave Clips, sure. If, like, that Blood Crypt comes back. <laughs> I like Seagate. I do, too. Probably played over Spellseeker. Stop wearing those dumb glasses. Be more natural like Mike. Oh, my bad. That's my bad. Here, let me put my natural eyes on for you. Oh, through the breach. Oh, now we're talking. I have to take my glasses off when I'm serious. I'm like, that's it. This upsets me. <laughs> it's just Breach, right? Yeah. Definitely. I like Flame Tongue Kava too, but... I mean, we got... Three Breachy boys. Oh, Breachy Boys. Do you want to talk about my Breachy Boys? No. You will. This is your pick? Yes, because mm -hmm. I took through the Breachums. Uh, Do the right thing. Fire and Ice? Yeah, that's the right thing. Man, like nothing. Nothing in here. Literally Abzan.deck over here. You don't like Untap Boy? Eh, he's alright, but I mean, I'm not probably not going to play him. Ooh. I like Vandal here. Yeah, me too. <clears throat> Man, we got Breach and Sneak Attack. Oh boy. And this is one of the good, this is one of the good, good uh, Eldrazi, because it gets to Annihilate. Gotta keep Annihilating. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's fascinating. Hmm. Now we take Goblin Guide. Do we? Yeah. I feel like I have an eyelash in my eye. Not enjoying it. You can board into Goblin Guide. They'll never see it coming. They won't because they'll be like, wow, that's a terrible sideboard plan. Hey, man, your pick. Doesn't matter. I'm just taking this. No, my pick was Goblin Guy. This is my pick. Okay, I'll take the Blood Guest for you. We got no fixing lands. That's really sad. Okay, this is 28 cards. I think you can cut Faith of Saluting. I also think we can cut Spellseeker. Sure. And Augur. There we go. Well, that's still 25. That oh, doesn't. That looks like 23 from here. <laughs> Maybe it's because you got these friggin' weirdo glasses on. Spellseeker is uh, search your library for an instant or sorcery with converted mana cost two or less. So it can pretty much get... I mean, it's better in the Vintage Cube because you can get all your broken stuff. 
scout red cap. We can take out one more thing. Sword actually does nothing. That's a good call. Yeah, all right. So this is this is what we want. Yeah, all right. We're just going to play 8-8, eight, eight, I guess. Yep, perfect. Perfect deck. Mike, what sound does the little goblin god make? That's good. That was a good goblin god noise. for you good for you i use my special eyes you don't have special eyes your eyes are shit you have shit eyes michael how dare you how dare you now we gotta wait for an opponent why is it taking so long this is the vintage this is a cube buddy they're still drafting oh they need to stop they did Oh, wow. This hand's kind of poop, but I'm going to keep it because we got days. S words abound. God. I like that you say S words abound and then the very next message you say it. Someone big fan you? Yeah, they said, thanks for all you do for the community. I was like, hey, man, thanks so much. And their name is Breakfast for Dinner, and I'm like, that's a good name. They're going to play two drop, and we're going to daze it, and it's going to be like, whoa. Is it? Do I daze that? I don't think so. I don't want to go back on mana. I'll never go back. Oh, Dynamo? Dynamite. No, Dynamo. Dynamo! That's getting days. Dynamo, Dynamo. Let's draw a three drop. Okay, Mountain is good too. Thanks. Thanks! Can you imagine if we had that Sinister Sabotage here? We could just counter something. Man, wouldn't that be real good? Oh, and so they just have the deck doesn't mean we're gonna draw it. Nah, we would, we would, Michael. Wow. We would. Actually, I think we're just fiery confluencing and killing both of these guys. Because next turn we can play Dynamo into Solemn, which is insane. Uh, deal one damage each creature. Let's just three it up. Wow, and they missed the land drop, so that's really wow. That was such a great wow, wow, wow. Champion of Doodoo's. Wow. I'm currently pushed. That was amazing because, like, we would have both of these guys would have died to Wicker Brow Elder. So if we didn't top deck that fiery confluence, whew, and now we can do the do the do the magic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have ten mana right now, <clears throat> along with a sorcery and an instant. So Emrakul is almost castable. That's pretty cool, my dude. Oh yeah, we just did it. Our deck is insane. Our deck is exploding. Are you, are you, are you ready? <laughs> my God, you're so you're you're so weird, Michael. Oh. <gasps> 11, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7. Oh, we're so close, dude. What if we attack and they block and then we just play Emrakul? Oh, dang. I knew it was too good to be true. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 
or one away. That's so sad. I guess we just cast it next turn. Well, that's better than the other one. I think we just hold that. Because we can play it and cheat in anything we want to, but like when we if we play it, we just put it at risk for like a you know. You know. You know, thing. You know, you know. Also, our people here would be amazing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We float four. We get to replay Thran Dynamo, play land. They only have two cards in hand. Well, we don't have a fuel on our deck anymore, so. Yes, we do. I'm pretty sure we took it out. We definitely did not take it out. I definitely brought it back in. Once we got Thran Dynamo and um, I think that's the only thing I really needed, but I put it back in for sure. It's not on the sideboard. I brought it in. Okay. You just didn't notice me bringing it in because you're a dummy. I take offense to that. I take offense to your... Me and the dummies are tired of your attitude, okay? You and the dummies? Is that the yeah. name of your band? Yeah. Mike and the dummies? Oh, wow. Now you want to... Oh. Pay six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. So we're just going to... Three, four, five, six. We're just going to play this. Fail to find. Seder Wayfinder. Main. Um, search for, for up to two? Sure. Then we get to look at your whole deck. Oh, yeah, that's gas. Can I clip this fast enough? Oh, we won the game, but I will still clip it. Clip it and ship it. Well, I'm going to clip it now because it's just easier to look at. Nope, don't want to save it. I want to reclip it. That'll do. Whoop. Let me see this deck, buddy. Let me see your entire... No, it's not the whole deck anymore. It's just the creatures, I think. But Oh, you're oh, you're right. That's really sad that it took away the good cards. That's weird that it would do that. Huh. Oh, well. I guess we know the creatures, at least. Prime Speaker and Hydroid Crassus have been added to the cube. Oh, Mary Mo. She's All right, it's time to bring it in. Bring in the Goblin Boy. No, we're not bringing in the Goblin Boy. Right. <laughs> but that's how he sounds. I do kind of want to bring in Murderous Red Cap because it kills a lot of their things. Take out that stupid Bubble Boy. Why? Yeah, you might be right. Lay off me, I'm starving. Yikes, was I lazy for a bit. Sorting out my laundry thinking I should wash some clothes and find three pizza boxes for my brother who's here under... Oh my god. That's no good, buddy. I guess that I guess they are empty. That's that's a silver lining there. That was a good throwback you did there. What? Lay off me, I'm starving. That was in the chat. But I mean, yeah, I, I agree. It was, uh, it was a good Chris Farley moment. Uh-oh. It is time. Not yet. It is time. No. Did you hear what I said? Oh, this thing's dead. Oh, Fire and Ice and Chart, of course, huh? I kind of want both of these. Then both you shall have. Because next time we can play her, we can attack with Thopter, Chart, of course, draw two. Still have mana for Fire Ice. Actually, we could kill this, too, with Fire Ice. Yeah, it's only bad if it's a Rattle Claw. Then, uh, then with the, they get a bunch of mana. And it was. It was Rattle Claw. So next turn, they'll pay two. They'll add three. So four, five, six. They could presumably have six mana next turn if they, if they had a land drop. Did they just whiff on four? Oh, man. This is brutal. Ooh. 
Wow, they just put four cards. They didn't hit a land. This is yikes. We built Yikes City on rock and a roll. Oh. You know this song, man? No. You don't know this song? No. I don't believe you. Corporation Games. <laughs> Fine, this is a joke anyway. After all, I'm paying you with your money. That's from Rounders. Ever seen that movie? No, man. You've never seen Rounders? Holy smokes, man. Oh, they're going to shuffle that along back in. Oh! Wow, you're really doing well here. I caught it. How's that water doing? It's okay. Spilling water, knocking glasses off your desk? I didn't spill water, okay? It's condensation, sation, sation. Is it? I'm tempted to block so then I can fire a confluence for one and kill the whole board. Just in time for my... Just in time, the river bend. That's not a saying. You're right, it's not a saying, it's a song. It's not a song either. It's You're literally not a song. Okay. You're a meatloaf sandwich. I'm a meatloaf sandwich. Yeah. Uh, deals one to each creature, two damage to each opponent. Cast one, two, three, four. Just around the Michael B's. Now I have to decide if I should be grumpy at my brother for leaving pizza boxes under a blanket or myself or not. I think both. You don't have to choose. And this is how we do it. <clears throat> Water's doing just fine. Oh, that thing's dead. How is it dead? You have no way to kill it. That's true. Five, six, seven, eight mana. So we can go Skargon, and Hellkite. Attack for basically a billion. Do we just want to haste this? Is this yeah. four? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, yeah. One and a two and a three and a four. Gonna tap these mirrors for more. And just 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So they go to 2 here if they don't block. I think they might be dead. So let's just find Lightning Bolt and kill them. Oh god, what do you do when you want both? I'm just going to take the big boy. We still have through the Breach in the deck, and we also have... Uh... They're dead. doesn't matter. They have to kill both of these this turn. I don't think it's going to happen. I'm going to preemptively... I'm not going to say it. I, I was going to wait. I was just going to preemptively type it. I wasn't going to send it. You guys know how it works. Michael B. Living in the garbage can. That was a solid 2-0. That's a big 2-0, buddy. <clears throat> You're a big 2-0. Dirt Burgle. Remember that time you lived in Dirt Burglesville? This hand's rough. Folks. I never left. Wow. I'm proud of my Dirk Virgo's Bill heritage. Is Cube a breath of fresh air or what? Boy, is it. Oh, God. This is worse. Yeah, this is basically a mulligan. This is keepable. Oh, boy. Maybe we'll play a thing we can lightning bolt. Maybe. Honestly, two swamps doesn't scare me that much. That's the thing I can lightning bolt. Hooray. Okay. Michael B's in my wigwam. Am I? I don't know. Well, that's a thing we can kill too. Dang it. What are you... Oh, boy. <laughs> That's not what we want to see. Yeah, that's much more annoying. Technically, he is in your wig. Well, that's a good point. That is a good point. What are you doing? I'm playing the trumpet, Michael. 
You'd know if you were actually you're playing the trumpet. If you knew how instruments worked. You know, I don't think you are playing the trumpet. Prove it. There's a video of you without a trumpet. Where? Moving your hands. Show me the video. You got to watch the playback on Twitch. I don't have to do anything. You're trying to prove something to me, man. I have to go out of my way to, to help you prove something to yeah. me? Wow, they just killed... That's, that was rude. I hope you never come back here again. <sighs> I guess we're just going to pass here. This is... All, I feel like I, I had... I feel like I'm losing. I don't like it. I don't enjoy it. No, sir. Don't like it. Don't talk to me or my son ever... My Thopter son ever again. Ooh! -wee. Guys, can you in the chat? Can you guys not pull out your meat flutes? Because this is not. Oh, that's a good one too. Dang. Well, butter my biscuits, Michael. Michael, are you gonna butter my biscuits? Pulls out his meat scepter. <laughs> are they gonna forget to Liliana here? That would be such gas, dude. They never will. Why would you want him to do that? Why would I want him to forget to Liliana? Yeah. Why wouldn't I? Where's your spirit of sportsmanship? Oh, they just milled and got their graveyard marshal back? Oh, wow. If I can hit a land, I can bounce this and kill their Liliana? That feels too good to be true. Wait. They return no cards to their hand? What? Oh, God. Well, I guess I could tap this, actually. Another five drop, huh? Well, see you later. Wow, that was insane that you just didn't choose to get this back. Did they only think they can get a card of the ones that were flipped? Like, flip two cards if one of them is a creature you can put in your hand? Because that's weird, because you could have just grabbed this graveyard marshal. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Delivery. Beep, 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 beep. Bing, 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 bing. Ring, 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 ring. Who knows delivery? Yeah. You don't know about little Unos? I don't know about little Unos. What is little? Who's little Uno? The pizza boy. Little Unos is the pizza boy. Mm -hmm. Are you drunk? What am I not? Usually every day. I put it in an IV bag. Of what? The alcohol. What alcohol? All kinds. All kinds of alcohol. <laughs> oh, Lord, Michael. You need to go back to the, the poor house. Send him to the ranch. Are you... Yes. What, when did you wake up, man? Uh, 1.30-ish. 1.30-ish. I'll keep this hand. Well, technically, I woke up at 1, and then I had snooze. And then I had snooze, and then I had snooze, and then I had snooze, and then I woke up. Sure. What if, uh, here's a crazy idea. Mm -hmm. What if you went to bed at a time that would allow you to sleep until baby one, but then wake up rested? I don't understand. Mm. Doesn't make any sense to me. Okay, well, that's. There's so little trumpet you can't even clip its non existence. He's right. <laughs> Frank and his radical views. Calm down, buddy. Uh, I think it's fiery confluence here. I don't care about upheaval in this with this hand. Man, just being able to attack. Don't play. Don't play vampire nighthawk. Just let me attack with this guy. I asked you nicely not to play it. 
I asked you nicely. Uh, Don't make me hit you again. I mean, you can still attack. And then you just trade this guy? I'd rather just chart a course and discard something. Or I could just wait. I don't really have anything I need to get rid of at this particular juncture. Michael B. Is a garbage eating man. Puts it in. I need the attack. Did you? Yeah. Why would they hold that guy back? So you could never attack again <coughs> with my one three. Yeah. I'll, I'll. I think I'll. I think they'll be all right. Oh god! I really wish I could get rid of that. Now I'm probably just gonna fiery confluence everything. Not like I want to. Why not? Why don't I want to? Yeah. Because I did a two for two. And they get two one ones out of it? Seems like a pretty no, obvious no, no. reason, when right? You, when you kill a fire with confluence, the aftermath doesn't happen. Wow, really? Mm -hmm. Let me see if that's true at all. Okay. Actually, hold on. Let me just... I'm going to attack first. If they let me attack and they don't block... Because they might be like, oh, you might have magma jet. They're probably just going to take one here. And then I might actually just chart a course and let them play more things. Because I'm playing a red deck with a bunch of two damage spells. Why would you block here? That's the dumbest thing I've ever... I, I'm just like, I don't, I'm sorry. I'm not saying my opponent's dumb, but like... That's such a silly thing to do when you literally saw Fire and Ice and Magma Jet. I guess you didn't see Magma Jet, but you still saw Fire Ice. And that's like... Why would you not... Also, we're just playing red in general, so... That's so weird. Now I think you fire Confluence. I mean, I'm almost tempted to chart a course. I'm just going to chart a course because if I hit a red spell that can deal with this now... Yeah, that's actually all right. Because now we can still let them play another thing and fire Confluence. Like, maybe they'll play a Graveyard Marshal or something. Oh, Graveyard Marshal, keep on rolling. Your singing voice is really nice. Noise? No. Australian for noise. Well, let me see what this clip is. It did take a Whoa, little, little while. <laughs> got him. Wow. I got him. By the time I try to wake you up. Can't wake up. By the time I try to wake you up inside. Why is Evolving Wilds in the Legacy Cube? That feels weird. Because it's a legacy staple, duh. That's pretty good. One, two, three, four. They just sack like four lands and keep both of these, right? I'm just going to cast this and put them to two things. Actually, hold on. What do they take with this? Ten? So good. Yeah, we're not there yet. We could play this in haste and attack for four. Yeah, I just don't want to go to... They have six power on board. That's just more than I'm feel like dealing with here. Deals one damage to each creature slash N. Deals one damage to each creature slash N. Deals one damage to each creature slash N. I mean, there's just as much fixing in Legacy as there is in... Uh, in vintage like there's no more in vintage like you still have all the signets you still have all the lands every land and, and and artifact that you can fix with in in vintage is legal and legacy well I mean but evolving wilds is in so many legacy decks you know it's true that's why evolving? What that doesn't make any sense. I don't understand. Oh, and now we can just shoot both of these guys too? Good lord. 
One, two, three, four. Even if they, they're going to sacrifice. Oh, we just shoot these first and they have to sack lands. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. What if they have mana tithe? I'd cry, dude. They better. Are you familiar with the concept? Yes, I am. Are you familiar with the concept of text uh, being being poorly able to convey sarcasm, which is why the kappa was introduced to clarify that it is indeed sarcasm. Don't have anguish on making. That's all. Got to bring. Gotta stop bringing so much tood. Who? The guy. Just My dad. So much tood. No, I've, no worries. All's forgiven. I actually didn't know you're being sarcastic. Because you actually... Don't forget to attack. I mean, there's not that much fixing in Legacy as a format, right? Like, that actually makes much more sense as a sarcastic comment. What is this you're doing? Don't do this. Don't cast out. What's happening right now? I don't know. I think they're drunk. This is my impression as well. Utter end? Is Utter end in the cube? I think it's the making, probably is. Braskas, sure. Guess they wanted to keep their lands. Suckers. Thank you! Does that make them suckers? Yeah. Well, I'm praying to thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Welcome back. You can just play more lands, right? So why not sacrifice them? You can't play more Vraska's Contempt. There's only one. <laughs> Dummies. Wait, when does this go off? Next turn? Oh, that's exciting. Can oh. we do both? No. We don't have nine. <laughs> we have eight. <laughs> I think I'd rather just play this guy. So then when we have nine, we can play this and then activate his ability on the same turn. One, two, three, four. So we have four and four. I'll just get a I'll just get an island. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So now we can play this guy and also shoot them shooty McTootie in the face. I think for Mike's birthday we should get him some eye drops. Maybe. I have found it weird that Mike wears the glasses almost consistently now. It's very strange to me. They bring out my beautiful eyes. No, they don't. I'm sure they do. How do they do that? Ancestral Vision unsuspended. It just feels... There's nothing like it. Oh, wow. Happy... Oh, wow. Two lands in a daze. Oh, wow. That's that's okay, though. Lightning Bolt? <laughs> Both lands. Lightning Bolt this. Keep up Mystic Confluence. And days. We got it all. What's up, Morgan? Always a pleasure, buddy. Michael, you're looking, you're looking real beautiful on your birthday, buddy. What sounds little man make? Mao. <laughs> oh, fantastic. Just fantastic. If you guys haven't done so, definitely go to coolstuffinc.com and check out my article that went up today. Um... I actually go over all some, uh, not all of them, but a few of the cards that I want to. Uh... Do I care about this? What do you get rid of Dak Faden? I think we care about that. Eh, it doesn't. It doesn't end the game. No, it's fine. Uh, go check it out. It's about some of the cards I hope that are in Modern Horizons for the modern format. Oh, you did make a comment about the Vindicate art. I saw that comment. If you guys, I would appreciate it if you guys actually go comment on the actual article itself, just so they know it's well received. And um, so, if you guys are on the article, I check all the article comments. But if you guys are ever reading my articles, just definitely comment on the article itself, so that it gets feedback and you know it looks, it just presents better. One, two, three, four, five. Scar. Are you hopeful for some new cube cards in Modern Horizons? Yes, I am. I'm hopeful. For, I'm hopeful for everything in Modern Horizons. That's all I ever wanted. Yeah, I can't wait for them to put Strip Mine in there. Yeah. 
Ah, strip mine would be great. JK, please don't put strip mine in. I keep. I, I also address people talking about like him to Torok and Wasteland and stuff, and I'm like, this isn't an excuse for them to just throw the most broken cards in Modern, buddy. Um, that's unfortunate. Oh, we also couldn't have countered that anyway. Like, I wouldn't want to spend like a million. I can see him. Yeah, maybe that's too good. No, him and Modern. Come on. It's only two cards, man. What does that mean? It's only two cards. It's not random. Yeah, but it could randomly be two of your <coughs> worst cards. I guess you're right. I guess you're right. This this Solemn Simulacrum is really going to go the distance here. Let's just draw Emrakul so we can cast it. Well, that's close to an Emrakul. Oh, to be clear, Mike is just joking. He's literally just playing devil's advocate. No, him must be real. No, him must be him real. Him must be real. Also, strip mine, sinkhole, and uh, mind twist. Yeah, mind twist seems safe in, in modern. More like modern twist. Do we just draw through with Mystic Confluence? I feel like the odds of us countering something at this juncture are pretty low. But well, we can we can never lose now. <laughs> Deep analysis. I love that you can choose which player. I'd be like, you draw two, man. Knock yourself out. You can make them draw four, man. Then they'll be milled out. They're basically yeah. dead. <laughs> this is nice because we can go Thran Dynamo and still keep up Mystic Confluence. God, Thran Dynamo is so broken, dude. You get to pay four and then immediately use three of it. So it literally, it costs you one mana most of the time if you can still utilize the three mana you're getting. The answer to do we draw three is always yes. That's true. I I agree with you. Five, ten, thirteen mana. I guess we're just gonna Emrakul here, right? Seems good. I hope they have like Council's Judgment so I can cast it on their Oblivion Ring. One, two, three. Pay six. One, two, three, four, five. Six. We are one shy of playing. Uh, keep Sorry, we got days up. We good. <laughs> That'll do. That'll do, pig. Let's go to game three. Is this game three? I actually don't know. I think it's game two. If only there was some way they could display that in their client. <laughs> if only there was some way. Backstreet's back. Did you know that? All right. All right. Oh, Mud Sonster, thank you so much for the for the for the Patreon uh, support. Really appreciate it, buddy. Really appreciate it. And Miracle. So we can't cast this. I think we're still gonna cast mm, Peanut. Shut Peanut. up and take my money. Cube is back, so here's five bucks. Damn, thanks so much, man. Really appreciate it. All right. Yeah, well, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Is this bounce or turn a creature to its owner's hand? Dang. If we had one more mana, we could actually bounce our own Emrakul. No, it has protection from instance, doesn't it? Yes. That's so weird. I mean, I guess we still get to do nonsense on their turn, right? Oh my god, we can play their Conclave Tribunal on either one of these. Oh boy. Oh, Billy boy. Okay, so let's go to their main phase. One, two, three, four. Okay, I can't cast this yet because they retain priority. So we're going to click OK. I'm going to cast this. Bounce an island. Okay, pay one. No. 
<laughs> oh, get some value out of that daze. Is it opponents? Dang. That's pretty frustrating. I mean, I'd still rather use it now than when we have something better, so. Oh my god, that's so stupid. Why do they do that? I guess we'll just take a Thopter. That's stupid, man. All right, so we know they have Island in hand, or Swamp in hand, rather. So, let's see if that means anything. Mike Street's back. All right. Why not exile Dynamo? Wait, why would I ever exile my Dynamo? Because actually, if we draw upheaval, it's utterly insane. That's good, too. Because then we just get to bounce this. We get Dak and Emrakul immediately into play, and they have nothing. Actually, upheaval is insane against all of these. Like, they have all of these... Uh, these Heidi boys. One, so five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I guess we're just playing this. Heidi boy, the furniture maker. Heidi boy. Mm -hmm. The furniture maker. Mm -hmm. Who is that? You know about Heidi boy? No one knows about Heidi boy, the furniture maker. Literally, no one. No human being knows about Heidi Boy, the furniture maker. No, uh, I do. What do you know about him? He lives down on 6th Street. Why do you know where Heidi Boy, the furniture maker, lives? Because we're good friends. Where does he live? 6th Street. 6th Street and what? And 35th. 6th Street and 35th. 35th what? Avenue. No, this is a no. I'll draw one and I'll counter two. That's what's known as a yikes for me, dog. Right, but if we... Okay, so if we upheaval, if we exile our own dynamo... Um, also, we don't have enough mana to... Uh, I guess we have enough mana to do everything, really. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Stop it, Morgan. Stop being ridiculous. See, look, the chat supports me, okay? Heidi Boy going to the corner store. I'm currently sitting on a genuine Heidi Boy right now. I know about Heidi Boy Furniture the American lives on 6th Street and 35th Avenue. Oh, my God. The delay on my iPad is real. That's too bad. You should sell it and get a... I wish this guy destroyed enchantments. Am I right? Eh? Yeah, that would be better. Oh, UPS is here. They're delivering my... They're delivering my package. Oh, Ups is here? Ups! Actually, Sword of Feast and Famine seems pretty good here. All of their- almost everything they have is black. Black, 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 number one. Is that your famous song? It's my famous song, yeah. Oh, for all you guys who just uh, commented on the article itself, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You guys are great. I love you guys. I, everyone who gets that typo negative reference is unbelievable. I'm always so blown away that people get that, like, 25-year-old typo negative reference. That song, Look at that face. 1993. So what is that, 26 years? That's insane, man. Yes, I also have another article over on Collector Legion, on the Collector Legion website. We talk about, I talk about my, my top six cards in, in Modern that are the biggest villains in the format. I like you enough to comment, but not to open if that's fair. I will allow it.
Hecatomb. Huh. What is Hecatomb? Like, sack four creatures and, like, draw cards and stuff? Wasn't it, like, the, um... Wasn't it, like, a poor man's Necropotence back back when Necro... Ne ne Time and Untap Swamp, you control it to his one name target? Oh, no. When it comes into play, sacrifice unless you sacrifice four creatures. Tap and Untap Swamp, it deals one damage to target creature or player. That's... It's a very interesting card. Also, I submitted 41. I don't even care. Oh, this seems... God, you were so loud with your ice, my dude. I thought we were playing 41. No. Black, 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 number one. Uh... There's my Collector Legion article as well. I will keep this hand. Or as the kids know, the last shop Alex cheated at. The last shop Alex will ever cheat at. Wow, that's interesting. Interestingly aggressive. I mean, we got Seagate Oracle. You know who blocks the 2-2? The 1-3. Your boy. Oh god, what are they doing here? Is this going to be a Jitte? Uh, no... It's gonna hold. It's gonna turn us back a few turns, but whatever. It's gonna turn us back a few turns. I mean, if we draw Ancient Tomb, it's pretty cool because we can go turn two Seagate Oracle. What up, Rob? Oh, that's good too. All right, so once we hit three mana, we're good to go. It's gonna take a while. I wish we were on the play of this game for for real. What are you doing? Don't worry about it. Oh, it affects me. How does it affect you? Because I'm on the stream with you. I was just adjusting my glasses. How's that working out for you? Meh. What? Meh. What's wrong with you? You don't speak Gorblin? No one speaks Gorblin. I do. What did you say then? I said hello. Oh my god, you have to have this every single game on turn four? We're probably dead just because of that. That's really frustrating. But you bounced it. Oh, good. Then never mind. Yeah. Then there's no problem. Right. Right. Correct. Right is rain. So we hmm. take six here. I guess I feel like we just have to play Thran Dynamo and just hope for the best. <sighs> like if we get an upheaval, it's actually okay. But like we really just we're basically just hoping that we one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, we'll have eight mana. Yeah. Like upheaval or bust is really what we're at right now. Yeah, this is pretty bad. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Actually, we can bounce three of their guys and play a Seagate Oracle. That's actually pretty good. That does give us another turn. None of these are great. I mean, I don't think we're going to win, but... Are you going to just kill this guy on the spot? If you just exile this guy on the spot, then we're just totally dead. Wow, that's real mature. You're basically a child. Actually, can we counter that bounce two guys? No, then we still die. Okay. Well, we tried. Wait. Wait, what? Why didn't you counter that and bounce two guys? Because then they still have two guys, and we block one, and we take at least two, and then we die. Oh, yeah, you had to bounce three. Gotcha. God, he's so... See this? If you're not looking over there, 
randomly on the stream, then you'd be able to know. Then you'd be like, oh, I know, I know exactly what's going on because I'm paying attention to the game. Instead, you do this all the time. Hey, man, I'm looking at the game right I now. I feel like I'm the teacher, and uh, I'm trying to, like, your parent comes in for the parent-teacher conference, and I'm like, yeah, Mike just stares off into space a lot. He would be really, he would be a great student if he just applied himself, but he just stares off into space. Meh. That's very good. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, Lord. Oh, God, look at this beautiful hand. It's not... I mean, okay, I actually feel like we could chart a course here. I think it's fine. Really? Yeah. Yikes. It got worse. Don't you know the rules of the moto? No. That if you have a bunch of lands in hand, you, you just draw keep drawing lands, yeah. Well, they turned off our chart a course for a turn. I'd rather not take an extra two to chart a course here, so. Undrum Tuna, what's going on, buddy? His tuna isn't even dreamed yet. Her? Or her. There you go. Nailed it. Oh my god! <laughs> That's pretty good. Boop, boop. Can I boop them both? Can I get a little boopers? So long, a little brutal. board. Put your guys in the trash can. Oh, I see. You just want to play the Johnny, I guess. Well, that's unfortunate. Give me a Scargan Hellkite. Oh, sneak attack? All right, it's better than an island. Also, if we just draw uh, a beautiful land next turn. I hope they think this taps a creature instead of actually just keeping something. Dang it, they didn't. Dang it. Oh, batter skull. Wow, this is going well. Two, three, four, five. Well, if we had one land, we can actually put this guy into play. This is awkward. You're right. Wait, hold on. One, two. We can. We can still do. It. We can ancient tomb, sneak attack, batter skull. Yeah, let's do that. Here comes Michael Cottontail. Hopping down the Michael Trail. Hippity hoppity Michael's on its way. It's true, I am on its way. So if we attack with just this guy, they have to block a Johnny would go to one. Yeah, I think we could save the... But if we attack with this, they can block here and then a Johnny dies. Like, this just gains them four free life, I feel like. If they want to chump block here and keep a Johnny at one, I think that's fine. Because nothing, tapping down nothing here really doesn't, doesn't affect us too much. Uh, okay, yes. Boop and a boop and a boop and a boop. No, we're not going to tap one mirror. I want to put a Johnny to one. <laughs> if we tap one mirror, Johnny goes to four, and then they can still just chump block here. And then a Johnny stays at four. That's not ideal. Oh, they're just going to let a Johnny die. That's actually fantastic. Toad's cool with that. Dippity hoppity a Johnny's on. I'm probably just going to take four here. A Johnny's on his way. It's like a Johnny Santa Claus, you know what I mean? Or is it Peter Rabbit? Peter Cottontail? God, it's so confusing. Oh, you have every Thalia, huh? All two of them. There's only two Thalias, right? A Mystic Confluence would be great. Or a Fiery Confluence, rather. There's only two Thalias? Yeah, there's only two Thalias. Can you imagine how good Fiery Confluence is in this position? You just destroy this artifact and deal two to all creatures. Seems good. Oh, the forward. wrong confluence. I mean, it's still pretty good. It actually is pretty good. We can bounce all three of these, actually. Uh, bounce. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 bo
What do we got? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. Oh, and there's five in the graveyard. We can just cast Emrakul next turn. Ooh, -wee. seems decent. It does, but it comes into play tapped because of the Thalia that they're going to replay. Why does that matter? Because it. Why does it matter? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know why I just work here. <laughs> That's true. I do just work here. The problem is I'd rather like to to run their Thalia into the Emrakul itself, but... Okay, so if we bounce Thalia... Thirteen, they can block the two two. They take three, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, six, seventy. Yeah, actually that might be lethal. That might be exact. That seems good. We could also make it so this guy can't block, but they're just going to block the 2-2. Two, two. They'll take 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. That's exact seize. Whew. Artifact doesn't matter. They're still dead. Do, 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 do. My name is Michael. I live in the garbage can. Singing about the garbage can. My name is Michael in the garbage can. I live in a garbage can and I sing about garbage cans. We meet again for the squarest of times, now in 3D. Mike already has his 3D glasses on. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Yes, Michael, you live in the garbage can. And you sing about your, your house. Your house is the garbage can. What's the confusion here? You know, I don't know. You don't know what the confusion is? Why are you looking at the walls? Why do you keep looking at the walls? Why? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I just do it sometimes. I don't know. What you know to it's tell all you. the time. I just weird to look over and you're not even facing me. I'm like, oh, you're just looking over there at the, in the complete look, other man, direction. Sometimes the wall is more interesting than you. Okay, I didn't want to say it, but well, I I appreciate you saying it. At least now I know. You know, it's it's important that I know. I think. Thank you for being honest. You're welcome. So I appreciate your honesty. This seems like a keep. Yeah, this seems better than... Didn't we mulligan to like... No, we just kept like the seven hand with uh, a million things. Yeah, with a lot of lands. And it all worked out. It did actually. Oh, okay. super aggro. That we is. We have bolt though, so whatever. Oh man, we have a fiery confluence and a fire. And look at all the fire that we have in our hand right now. Shake that baby. Happy birthday, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord. Is he going to level up? If they don't, I'm just going to let it happen and then I'm just going to fire ice whatever they have on board. Or I'll just keep fiery confluence up and kill their hole. That was some good draws you had? I mean, not really. I opened on like seven lands. Well, then you did have good draws because all you had was lands. I guess so. My glasses just fell. Yeah, it's a technique. For all you guys who went to the article and commented, I love you guys and I really appreciate all of you. It's a technique? Yeah, watch. Wait for it. I'm waiting. I've been. I've been waiting for it. Mm -hmm. It's a real technique, <laughs> my dude. <laughs> Should you master it or still are we still waiting? I can't tell. When <laughs> when does the technique end? <laughs> okay, I messed up. They're too tight on the face. Oh, too tight on the face, the classic. <laughs> 
He just got out of the pool. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. Oh, God. Hey, man. You should get that package in between drafts. What package? Hmm? I mean the one we left? Yeah. Yeah, that'll give me an excuse to go get a Wawa. Well, yeah, okay, but after the draft, not right now. Right, yeah, yeah. It looked like you were getting up. getting up for no money <sighs> oh boy oh boy it's just getting worse I guess they I guess this guy gains indestructible maybe they won't no they will but doesn't matter yep it's still a one for one and we still get to keep up uh, fiery confluence oh Dak Faden or Jelly Boy Probably Dak Faden. That was a planeswalker. His eyes need to rest after all that workout. What? Yeah, now you're now you're like, my forehead hurts now, from all the from all the work that I've done. Three three, huh? Uh, yeah, I was take three. Oh, just give me a sneak attack, my dudes. What what what, what do I miss? Oh, I'm just laughing at that that gif. Which one? Oh, this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like one of the best ones ever. It's a real good one. Uh, I think we just discarded Lamog. But we have oh my god, what if we get like we have sneak attack and through the breach in our deck? We're definitely discarding one island and probably mirror battle sphere. Dang it! Now I have sweetie boy going to the corner store stuck in my head. I like that. That's a, like it's a song. <laughs> Sweetie boy going to the corner store. Oh, yeah. Sweetie boy. Sweetie boy. Sweetie, sweetie boy. Oh, doot and doot, 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 sweetie boy. That's a... Yeah. What? Yeah. What? Oh, we can actually go... Now we can't. Level up. Live, live, level up. Through the breach. Sneak, sneakums and sneak, sneakums and weakums. Sneakums and weakums. I'm going to get rid of... Two lands. Play this land. Play this. Play this. And then while I'm away... Mike will write home every day. And then it's Michael B's going to the corner store. Oh, I guess we just win. I didn't realize. Oh, I guess they're just stuck on infinite land. We could have they could have clued. They could have cracked their clue. This was the first Legacy Cube draft of this of this particular season, and it went well. I think two ones fine. And it also was pretty quick. Thank you guys for watching. If you're watching on Twitch, I'm definitely not going anywhere. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe. And check me out at manatraders.com. You'll get 20% off your first three months of any subscription with the link and promo code in the description below. Meundies.com slash Frank Laporte. You'll get 15% off along with free shipping. And check out Cool Stuff Inc. My article went up today. And uh, you can check that out. And uh, if you use promo code Frank5, you'll get 5% off all of your purchase. So definitely check those out. Thank you guys so much for uh, for watching. I'll see you next time.